A fairly fundamental question as to how the theory of change can guide the evaluation questions and evaluation design. Right. Another good question, and like early on, um, I was running a you know, introduction to evaluation um, sort of internal workshops for, for project managers. And we had this line that, you know, from the theory of change, you develop your key evaluation questions, which is like they sort of having a lot of books. And then we went, that's not really how we do it. You know, it definitely informs your key evaluation questions. It's really helpful. But it does, it, it, I don't think it's helpful to say from that you get your key evaluation questions because there are lots of parts of the theory of change that you might be interested in, right? You're not doing impact evaluation just to do it. You're not doing it because you're doing research. You're doing it because you care about your program. You want to do it better. You want to know if it works. You want to know when it works. If it does work, you want to know how to do it other places, how to scale it up or replicate it or sustain it. Like you really care about your program and, and the people it's trying to serve. So your key evaluation questions come from the framing of the evaluation. Why are you doing this evaluation? You know, what are you, who's going to use the information? What are they going to do with it? And therefore, what questions do they have? So that's where your key evaluation questions come from. And then you, your theory of change helps you think about how you're going to go and answer that question. Um, um, and then your evaluation design will come from uh, out of those questions, what are the questions you've got? It will come from something about the nature of what it is you're evaluating. And that's where I think um, the theory of change can be helpful because there's a big distinction between, you know, is this program necessary and sufficient to produce the outcomes? Well, then you can really use very simple counterfactuals to see the impact of it. But if the program only works in conjunction with other factors or only works in conjunction with other programs, if you actually need that synergy between them, then that should be reflected in your design because you're not just saying comparing with and without, you're saying I want to compare it with the rest of the jigsaw. Does that work um, compared to the others? So um, yeah, yeah, it certainly helps to inform it, but it, it's not that, that you um, it, it won't spit out your key evaluation questions. You have to come back to saying, who is this for?